All right. Communication target. Draw a target card, select target. That's already done. Determine and place sights. There's only two in each approach, nothing in the target. Now this target is small and hard. Minus one turn and secondary. So... Two targets per. Special sight indicator, no sight. 37 millimeter guarded by a light machine gun. Rifleman and another 37 millimeter. 20 millimeter and LMG. The thing with the 37 millimeters, they can go high and low as marked on their counter. So they can go high or low. There's no flying over them like we've been lucky flying over others. Special sight indicator means we replace that with a special sight. We get a photo. Anybody who's same and low, we gain one recon. Hmm, that's not bad. Okay. Assign pilots. I can send up to five. It takes three hits. Now, small means minus one to your die roll. Minus one to ATGs. Hard means subtract ones from one from the hits inflicted by each ATG attack. However, ooh, I don't know. We've got special weapons that will take care of that. They're plus against hard. Um, but let me figure out what I want to do. I've got Von Konzel left, and he there could be four, there could be four uh, aircraft out there. So I'm just setting them here. I'm going to move them to the correct pre-approach in a second. So I've got Von Konzel. I can send five. We've got an HE-111 that didn't fly, and we've got a JU-87 that didn't fly. And we've got two ME-110s that did not fly. Okay. So we're sending out a full thing. This is target number seven. I think we realized it was green. Oh, I'm sorry. It is yellow. Okay, so they're each going to get one stress plus a, it's going to cost me one fuel. Oh, this guy goes back. All right, prepare for mission. Let's load these babies up. I have four SO to spend. We're going to go PC 500 in here. along with his little guys. And Rosmanich is carrying a PC-500. He's actually going to carry two of them. That is four weight points, so he is full. So one, two, three special weapons. Have to remove three SO. Icky. Target number seven. We start with four. We've already lost three. But I know I'm getting one back, so that's that's good news. Hecht and Krautheimer are both flying. Krautner. We got Rosmanich. Uh, we have Steinbecker. So that's my five pilots flying this mission. Yay team. Okay, we are prepared for the mission. So we draw a target bound event card. Again, this is the top one. If a legendary pilot is present this mission, reduce campaign map stress suffered by two. 
Um, we don't have a legendary pilot on this mission, so it's kind of an aces card, but you can also have legendary pilots, so it works. Place aircraft, choose altitude. All right, let's see here. Rosmanich must be at low. Hmm. We're going to leave Krautner and... Now, everybody except Steinbecker is going low. The reason for that is Steinbecker's high right now, but he is going to be coming down to low. Okay, we have placed aircraft, choose altitude, remove proper number of fuel barrels. Well, we've got five aircraft flying, so we've got five fuel barrels leaving. Leaves us 20 for the rest of the day. Rest of the day is... Um, okay, so we remove proper fuel, fuel barrels, determine and place bogies. There's one per approach. Sadly, the no bogey fell second. And we have three three bogeys, one no bogey. So that's good news. We'll, we'll take the no bogey. We have three bogeys just waiting for us. Intel air adjustment. Well, this is nice because we get to remove one site. Um, none of them matter because of the way we're coming in, but I'm going to get rid of one of these 37 millimeters. That is our Intel adjustment. It hasn't been moved because of the previous battles yet. It's already there. Draw over target event card. This is the middle one. Ah, yes. Subtract, subtract one from sight and banded attack rolls. Finally a positive one. That one I hope I remember. Place turn counter in one box because it's minus one turn. I'm putting it in two. And here we go. First turn. Nothing happens. Everybody's at low. There are no nothing to attack. So everybody moves. Which means we're going to gain plus one recon. I'll put that there. Bogies and bandits move. This bogey flies in. Von Konzel goes ahead and grabs him. This guy moves in. Krautner gets him. Mad because he was shot down day one. And this guy heads into the center. Advanced turn counter. We're now at the start of turn three. Fast pilots attack. I do have one, but he's the dive bomber, so he can't attack. Oh, no, they, he's dead. Never mind. He is no longer a fast pilot when he's dead, just so you know that rule. I don't have any fast pilots, so nobody attacks. So it's bandits and uh, sights attack. There are no sights, so this bandit is going to, or this bogey is going to attack Krautner. Let's see what he is. Ooh, a newbie Spitfire. I used up all our veterans in the last battle. So a newbie Spitfire is attacking Krautner. To determine his success, his ATA minus friendly maneuver. Well, Krautner's minus one because he's an ME-110. So he's minus one, he's minus one, so it's even. A uh, three, he is trying a tight turn. So he is minus one, Krautner's ATA is minus one. So he is uh, even. And uh, Friendly Maneuver is minus one. And he's not carrying any waypoints, so he is plus one on his success. Shakes a seven, becomes an eight. He gains a position. This is something else I just want to make 100% sure I didn't forget, but I might have forgotten with Krautner because he's got a gunner. Um, so that Spitfire just put himself in the range of the gunner. This guy's got an ATA of minus one, so I need eight or higher to shoot him down with the gunner. And of course, I shake a three. Needless to say, he's coming into the attack. So his ATA is minus one. Krautner's ATA is minus one, so he's at even. Friendly Robust is one, so he's minus one. His position is one, so he's plus one. His action result was just that position, so he doesn't get any action result. But because of the subtract one from sights, he's minus one. 
Uh, Krautner. Yeah, he's going to take a stress. He's going evasive. Minus one from the die rolls. A nine and a seven becomes a six, which is a yellow. Stress. Okay, so now he's got four. All right, this bogey attacking Von Konzel. Green Spitfire. They must have used up all their veterans in day one. Uh, so this green Spitfire is plus zero. Um, friendly Maneuver is zero on the ME 109, so he's even on his choice. He shakes a three. He's also doing a tight turn. He is zero. Von Konzel is plus one, so he's minus one. Uh, friendly Maneuver is zero, so he's minus one on his success. Shakes a nine, which becomes an eight. He gains a position on Von Konzel. Sadly, other than the pistol Von Konzel always carries, he does not have any defense against that. So here comes the attack. He is zero. Tom is plus one, so he's minus one. Friendly Robust is zero. His position is one, so he's even. His action result is nothing, but he gets this, so he's minus one on his attack. Oh, Tom takes a stress. Minus one on his attacks. He's got an eight and a two, which becomes a one, so he misses. He swings and misses. That's it for slow, that's it for them. So now it's slow pilot's attack. Krautner is going to attempt to get undisadvantaged. So here comes that infamous say, uh, scissors. So friendly action success is a D10 plus friendly maneuver, which happens to be minus one. Friendly ATA, which happens to be minus one. <laughs> minus enemy TA, which is minus one. So he's only minus one on his success of a scissors. Six becomes a five. Scissors, five. Uh, minus one attack, doesn't matter, he's sideways. The gunner cannot fire, if you're wondering. The gunner cannot fire because he cannot initiate attack. He would only be defending when the Spitfire attacks them. Uh, next up, Von Konzel trying to do, he's going to do that same scissors. So his success is friendly maneuver, which is zero. Um, the friendly ATA, which is plus one. Enemy ATA, which is zero. So Tom is plus one on trying to succeed. He gets a nine. So he goes disadvantage to advantage and plus three attack. So he swung right around that green guy and is now plus three to attack. So his attack resolution is his ATA, which is plus one. Enemy ATA, which is zero. Position, plus one. Action result, which is plus three. So Tom is plus five. Needs an eight. Shakes a two. <laughs> oh, so he's, he swings and misses. All right. Uh, unengaged escort can attack anybody head on. So he's going to try and save his friend there. Can't do any maneuvering. He's coming right at him. So Hex... ATA is zero. The enemy's ATA is minus one. So he gets a plus one attack. Needs eight. Shakes one. Okay, guys, come on now. So that didn't work either. All right, aircraft move. Now, Tom can break that engagement, and the guy does not follow him because he is... Um, Advantage, so he's going to break that engagement and go after this bogey. Hecht is going to engage this Spitfire to keep him here. And the two bombers are going to continue on. Krautner's going to stay back. Bandits move. Well, none of them can move. They're all engaged. Uh, advanced turn counter. We are now in turn four. Go back up to the top. Dive bombers dive to low. Here he comes. Fast pilots attack, don't have any. Sights and bandits attack. Okay, we're going to do this one. He is zero. Friendly maneuver is minus one, so he's plus one on his choices. 
Eight plus one is nine. So he is attempting an in my sights. He is zero. Hect is zero. Uh, robustness is one. So he's minus one. Oh, I'm sorry. He's doing his maneuver. So zero, zero, friendly maneuver minus one. He's plus one on his action success. Why do they keep going into this corner? Three becomes four. In my sights, plus one attack. So he is plus one for that. He is zero. Hect is zero. Robustness is one. So he's back to zero. His position is zero. His action result was plus one. Right? Zero, zero. Minus one, plus one. So he's even. Um, familiar tune. Hect is taking a stress. Ten and two. So the two becomes uh, the choice of uh, die of choice, and he misses. Here we've got this newbie spit having some fun with Krautner. He's minus one. He has advantage, but doesn't change it. He's minus one, but the friendly maneuver is minus one, so they're even on his choice of maneuver. Shakes a one. He's trying to tight turn again. He is minus one. Hex maneuver is minus one, so we're even. And his ATA is zero. So, oh, I'm sorry, Kirchner's ATA is, Krautner's ATA is minus one. So the Spitfire is plus one on his success roll. Shakes a five, becomes a six. Plus one position. He is now behind him. Krautner's gunner gets one more chance to try and save the day. He needs an eight. Gets a six. Spitfire fires. He is minus one. Krautner's robustness is one, so he's even. Krautner's ATA is minus one, so he's plus one. Position, he's plus three. Action result, he doesn't gain anything. Down here we subtract one from sight, so he's plus two. Well, Krautner has to take the stress because otherwise it's going to get ugly. That's his last one before he goes shaking. Ten and six plus definitely more than plus two. So Krautner, for the second time this campaign, Krautner hits the silk. And he's hoping for a five or better. Woo he shook a five. So for the second time in this campaign, Krautner comes uh, roaring back after being shot down. I don't think I even have anything that goes that high in stress. So he's at seven. And he comes home. Drat. Okay, that battle's been fought. This battle, Von Konzel's going to find out what he's fighting. We got a hurricane. We got a green hurricane. So he's minus one. So he's trying to do a maneuver. He's minus one. Friendly maneuver is zero. So he's minus one on his choices. Shakes a three becomes a two. He's doing a tight turn. He's minus one. Konzel is plus one. So he's minus two. Friendly maneuver is zero. So he's minus two on his success. Shakes a one, which becomes a zero, which doesn't really matter. No effect. So he's coming at him. His enemy ATA is minus one. Tom's is plus one, so he's minus two. Friendly robust on the ME109 is zero. Uh, position, he doesn't gain anything. Action result, he doesn't gain anything. Uh, event card, he loses one, so he's minus three on his attack. Tom is not taking a stress. Shakes a two, minus three, and maybe Tom sent a bullet back at him. I'm not really sure, but he missed. No more sights or bandits to attack, so slow pilots attack. We're going to give Hect first opportunity. Hect is plus zero. He's minus one. Hect is minus one on his action success. He's going to do it in my sights. Three minus one becomes a two. That was not positive. He ended up on his side. 
Gunner again cannot initiate the attack. Von Konzel, he is plus one, his enemy is minus one, so he's plus two on his uh, maneuver success. Plus two. He's going to do it out of the sun. Plus two. Shake a five becomes a seven. Plus four attack. So Tom is plus one. The guy is minus one. So Tom is plus two. Um, Tom uh, for position. Let's see here. Friendly maneuver. Zero. Friendly ATA plus one. Enemy ATA minus one. No weight points. Um, he gets plus four from his action result. So Tom is plus five, shakes a five, Tom gets a kill. Green Hurricane goes down. That gets down three kills for the uh, for the campaign. Okay, other slow pilots. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to have Steinbacher drop his load. Now he's driving, dropping the two SC-50s, which do not gain, well, they lose um, a point in hard. Right, does it lose a point? I know in small, they lose one, and in hard, subtract one. So honestly, these guys can't hit. They're not going to, even if they hit, they're not going to get anything. So hard is subtract one hit, but this one is hard plus three. So the small is minus one. He is plus three. So he is plus two on that bomb. Plus his ATG is plus three, so he's plus five. And his dive is two, so he's plus seven. So he's already got two hits. Shakes a five. He becomes a ten, which means he... Destroyed the target all by himself. That's three hits. Correct. But just to make sure in case my math was off, Rosmanich is dropping two of these. They're plus three. plus three, minus, minus one because of the small, so they're plus two. Um, Rosmanich is plus three, so he's plus five on each of these. He needs to get it up so we don't, if we subtract a hit. Seven plus three is ten, we can subtract a hit, there's two more hits, so it's definitely destroyed, but we're giving the target to Steinbacher just because. And that's it for slow pilots attack. Aircraft move. Hecht is going here now, whether that, and that guy follows him. These guys are all now low. Uh, Go that way, the Spitfire can't catch them. They're going to go that way. Spitfire can't catch them, but they're going to deal with a couple of. They're going to deal with a couple of sights, but we'll worry about that when the sights shoot at them. Okay. Advanced turn counter. We're in the start of turn five. We go back to the top. Dive bombers dive to low. Fast pilots attack. Don't have any sights and bandits attack. This guy's going after Hecht again. Again, he is a zero friendly maneuvers minus one, so he's plus one on his choices. Shakes an eight, becomes a nine. His choices and in my sights. He's a zero. Hect is minus one, so he is plus one again on his success. Shakes a ten, which means he did succeed. An eleven is plus four attack in my sights. So he's zero. The robustness of a 110 is one. So he's minus one, but he gets one for the position and he gets four. So he's plus four. 
And the hecht, of course, takes a stress, hoping for one of these to be a one. Plus four. He got a one. How do you like that? He got a one and an eight. So he's going to take the one plus four is five. Hecht grabs a yellow counter. Stress. So Hecht goes up to three. He's still in the okay range, so that's good news. Okay, this site. Using a D6 which once again I always keep around here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four, so he's shooting at Steinbacher. Robustness on a Stuka is zero. So it's a four, eight, ten. Steinbacher's got some stress to spare, so he is doing that. Four, eight, ten. Shakes a one. And a two, so it really didn't matter. Both of them miss. Same numbers for the LMG. Shakes a two. He's going after after Rosmanich. Five, ten, and eleven. Rosmanich has a robustness of one, so now he's a. 6, 11, 12, so he can't kill him, so Rosmanich is doing nothing. He gets a 9, minus 1 is 8, which puts him in firmly in the yellow thing. Now, yellow does have KIA. Maybe just Rosmanich's luck. Stress. So you got the stress anyway. Okay. I would say Von Kanzel could strafe, but he's minus three, which means he is going to uh, miss everything. Slow pilot Hecht, still trying to save his life. He has. He'll get off the board, so that's okay. But his friendly action success is friendly maneuver, so he's minus one. Friendly ATA, Hecht, is zero, so he's still minus, minus one. But his uh, enemy ATA is zero, so he's minus one on his success. He's trying the scissors that everybody tries. Four minus one is three. Yeah, his scissors minus one attack. So his scissors failed. No other slow pilots attack. Aircraft move, end of turn five. These guys are off the board. So these four survived, but we lost two. Two aircraft. We lost two aircraft, the British lost one, and we can't keep going like this. We lost a pilot. That is not the way we want to go. Okay, let's clean up the board here. This card is no longer needed. So that goes into the dead event cards. Draw homebound event card. Save this card. Discard after flying a mission with a legendary bandit present. If you destroy it, gain three SO. We'll just put that one aside for a little bit. I like it. Wounded pilots damage aircraft. Shake for safe landing. We don't have any wounded pilots or damaged aircraft. So those are not happening. Record mission outcome, victory points, adjust recon and intel. Finally, we can do that because that was mission number two. So SO points remaining is right now target one. Or is one. We got targets destroyed, which is three victory, um, three victory points. I like it. Okay, photo. Warehouse is one recon, communications is one recon, and the photo is one recon, so we move the recon three. Excellent. We move intel one. It's now at one site, one bogey, which will definitely help. And we get a bonus here. We gain an SO. Woo! So now we have two for the start of the next mission. A 
these two targets are destroyed. Now, Tom got a hurricane. We marked that. He gets one experience, which now means Tom is going to promote. I'll take care of that in a minute. Krautner was destroyed, but he gets an experience. Rosen, Rosmanich gets an experience. Steinbacher was destroyed, but he gets an experience. And Puffer was KIA. So when I do the next mission, I will replace Puffer. And once again, the guys are not, not happy because we lost a pilot, we lost two airplanes. So that was not that was not a good mission, although we did destroy the targets, so all is good there. All right, add target card stress to all pilots. Oh, goody. All right, let's see here. You go to three. You go to three. You go to three. And you go to four. Hmm. Yeah, buffers go first. Okay. Uh, all right. Pilot stress recovery. Osmanich. Von Kanzel. Steinbacher. So that means he, his cool is one, so he goes back down to two. Osmanich's cool is nothing, so he stays at three. Von Konzel's is nothing, he stays at three. Hecht is nothing, so he stays at four. Gruber flew, who didn't fly? Mueller didn't fly, so he could lose. If you don't fly, you lose two stress plus your cool. Um, but he didn't fly, so he doesn't lose any stress. All right. Pilot promotion. Well, hello, Mr. Von Konzel. You are moving on up. Von Konzel was green. He needed three to move up. He got his three XP, XP so he's moving up to an average pilot, which is always a positive. Hang on, I gotta put a counter away here. And now let's find Von Konzel in our put away stuff. Von Konzel is now average. Now what does that mean? Well, he gains a zeal. Um, his stress goes up to five. His ATA is plus two. So he, uh, I'm sorry, he was green. Okay, so he had the zeal. Stress goes up to five. His ATA goes up to plus two. And his ATG goes up to minus two. So all in all, Good move up for Tom. All right, put him here. Let's get his cards back on. He gets three stress, and he gets that zeal. All right, once again, thank you very much for watching. This was mission, num mission day number two. So far, we've flown four missions. We've got uh, two, five, eight. We've got 10 victory points so far, which means we're already into poor. Hoo -hoo! But we're into poor with two days gone and three days to go. Uh, when I come back from mission three, Puffer is going to have to be replaced. He will probably be replaced with another JU-87. We're down to 20 fuel, two SOs. That's it. You have any questions or anything like that, again, I'm on Facebook. Um, I'm on the DVG Facebook uh, Stuka Leader group. I'm on Facebook by myself. I'm also on BGG. We've got the Stuka Leader uh, entry and we've also got uh, Zero Leader. Either one of those you can leave a message and I will get back to you. BGG is slower. Facebook is pretty fast. So just so you know that. All right. Any questions, let us know. But otherwise, we will see you for day three.